Well, let me ask you this. As a contractor, then, if you got somebody, you're doing that kind of work, and it's an insurance deal, is, is it worth you as a contractor keeping that relationship to say, hey, you know what? Maybe the margins on this one, it'll be a little more slim. I'm going to go ahead and do the job, or do you walk away from it and just say, hey, I'm not... I, I can't do it for this because it's going to cost yeah. me money. For me, to I'd rather just walk away. It depends on the relationship I have with my client. Um, but at least I got to make something, you know, because otherwise I'm, I'm going to end up in the hall. Right. If, if, if I just keep on doing that. And it's everywhere, you know. It's not like it's just going to be that one client. Right. And I, that, I, I asked that question because that very well could be the catalyst that starts the foreclosure stuff. You got homes that are undone, unfinished. People can't afford to fix them, so they walk away from it. Yeah, them. but the, the but the plan by the feds is to you know the, what caused the problem in the you know in the foreclosure times in the early two thousands was people lost equity and it took them right. years to recover. Correct. But now it's the federal government's plan, you know, to they actively want inflation between three and five percent per year because that way you know it's just it's make it's easier for people to recover so what do you do do you put your three or five percent you know with that inflation rate that's why stocks have been so successful for some people that's why people are now going to bitcoin right and you know and are people are people coming away from real estate i mean i came over obviously i'm you know i say to everybody i'm texas born and bred but I came over here in 95, you know, as an Olympic skating coach and once again in real estate to live my American dream. Then, you know, lo and behold, what happens, you get into real estate and in my generation, you get into real estate. But now there's even a line of thinking with some of the younger folks where they say, oh, no, I want to rent. Right. You know, to me, it's all about diversity. But what what happens you know now because of that three to five percent increase a year you know it's it the system is designed to you know for people to buy houses so their price goes up but l like you said it's very reciprocal you sell your house but then you've got to find another one, another one. and right. we've had instances where people have moved from california people have moved from canada to getting to the texas market because it's a hot market but then we, we had one gentleman moving from here, he sold his house, you know, um, out in Meridiana, and he wanted to move to North Carolina, and he can't find a house in North Carolina. Because it's a blanket, not just Texas, everywhere. Right. It's everywhere. And, you know, then you've got the deferred mortgages that are coming in and everything else that's helping that, and that's where people see the bubble stuff. Um, and that's where the problem's going to start when that sort of, you know, when the foot comes off the accelerator. What happens then? But I really can't see it happening because we haven't got the inventory. So no. perhaps people are going to come in, investors and such like. We've seen more cash investors than anybody else. We had an offer three weeks ago, four weeks ago, where it was a multiple offer situation. And the gentleman that won that offer was seventy thousand dollars above the list price. Wow. wow! It made no difference where the appraisal comes in. Yeah, no, no. And uh, I was going to make, make make a comment about the um, when when you mentioned that what what are the people going to do if they if they can afford to repair the home? Right. They they are selling it like that. As, as is. Yeah, as is. Um, I've, I've seen a couple of properties that they lowered down the price um, at least $15,000. They'll, 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 they're mostly investors. They, they just scoop it up yeah, and buy it. Boom. Like, 